Welcome to Celebrating Act 2. Celebrating Act 2 is the user manual for the second half of your life. Welcome to Celebrating Act 2, another vlog by Art and John. Hi, Art hey. and John. Hi. Hi, Art and John. Listen, it, this is an important one, Art. This is, this is not our usual fumping around. I mean, all our what are we going to talk important? about? John, our others are not important, really? Yeah, this is important. Oh, okay. Here's the deal. I have a dilemma. Oh, okay, this is hey, John. It's, this is a dilemma that a lot of people our age have. And the real question, and maybe you can answer this. You, you know, you're smarter than the average bear. Are we now in daylight savings time or standard time? I don't know which it is. I know what it is, and I'm angry, and I'm mad as hell, and I ain't taking it anymore. How's that sound for you? Okay. What, what are you angry about? I'm confused, and you're okay. angry. So here's the point, okay? Quite frankly, my dear, I don't give a damn, but... Yeah. Uh, because, you know, I can afford to make the adjustments to daylight savings, and we, so we just fell back for, for, into daylight standard time from... Uh, saving time. Uh, all right, but I don't know whether falling back is you saving fall, time. You fall back and you get more hours, and it's now we're into daylight standard time during the summer when you want to have more light sunlight at the end of the day to play golf in Michigan or whatever you do. If you, you spring ahead so that you get more daylight at the end of the day. But here's the deal, okay? Uh, I think we should get rid of it. it I think it sort of harkens back. The time when uh, kids walking, we heard about kids walking in school in the dark, so you need more time uh, in the morning to have some daylight. Uh, but I think it really came back time for, for, for kids who had to work on the farm. I heard also, whatever it is, we don't really need it. There are some places in the country that don't switch don't back know. and forth. There are some you places don't know. The, okay, you don't really need it. You have so no stay idea. With, stay with daylight, uh, with standard time. So that we don't have to switch, and it'll be a little bit darker for longer, and it'll be a little lighter for longer, depending upon you know the way they invented the moons and the Earth's rotating and all that stuff. Leave it alone, okay? You, know, you have no idea. Say, and, and then and then God created daylight savings time. He didn't do that. Okay? You still don't nothing, know. He had nothing to. He had nothing to do. I I spoke to them. The the group. There's a group up there. They said they had nothing to do with it. Somebody misused, you know, the, the, anyway, Congress has already, the Senate has passed permanent daylight savings time, which is wrong anyway, it should be standard time. And the House won't pick it up because I guess there are individual uh, districts around the country, some like it, some don't like it. But, you know, we don't need it anymore. We have electricity, we have lights, and get over it. Uh, I, I'm sorry, John, you will bring it up. All I can tell you is, I, all I can tell you is, since I don't know whether we're coming or going or daylight savings or standard time, I'm fine getting rid of it. I just don't know which one we'll end up with. Right. Okay, good. So we're, we're perfectly in agreement. We're, we're like aligned like, like two peas in a pod. And in fact, there's a third pea in the pod that's right there, too. You know, that yeah. we're all in alignment on this. Yeah. I, it doesn't matter to me. I, I, I can't tell the difference. Yeah, and, and I don't, and I don't see the benefit to it. And and in fact, in fact, there have been studies that show that during the week that you switch the clocks, whether it's back or forth, there are more heart attacks, there are more accidents because people's rhythms are off. And during that first week or two of getting adjusted, there are some negative impacts. And I don't know for whatever reason they changed it in the first place. I think those reasons long since have stopped. You know, it's like we grew up back east, and school started right after Labor Day. We're in the West Coast now. It seems that school starts in the early August. So, yeah. you know, there's no rules anymore. And get rid of it. It's a waste of time. Half the time, the car clock radios. I have a car. It's a, I, I clicked on daylight savings time. It didn't do it. I, so I turned it off. <laughs> I had to adjust the clock manually. Anyway, so we need to get over it, my opinion. I, I'm with you. Yeah. So, what do you what do you want to talk about this week, John? But you you didn't answer my question. I don't know. I forgot what the question was. You just made the question you, is: What are we on now? Are we on oh, standard, standard or daylight? Standard day, uh, daylight 
savings time is uh, summer and the spring. And, you know, when you have spring ahead, you get more sunlight at the end of the day. That That's what the trick is. Okay. That never made sense to me. I don't know. Why do you need more daylight in the summertime when the days are longer? Because I, I remember growing up in New York, the biggest thing about uh, that, I don't play golf, but people in Michigan or somebody on the border of Eastern to Central time, they had so much sunlight they could play golf till like 9 or 10 o'clock at night. So they liked it. Other than that, I didn't see any benefit. And certainly that was not a benefit to me. All right. None of it made sense. Good. We agree. We'll get rid of it. You and I can get rid of it. So we're going to be on, we're on standard time now. Leave well enough alone. That's it. <laughs> it's over. No more. Hey, I'm on retired time. That's what I'm on. You're not retired time. You Actually, I can tell you, John, you've got five episodes that need some uh, uh, spiff enough to, to do. You need to write the descriptions. You've got uh, no time to retire. Nah, you've got trees. I'm, not, I'm nah, too busy. Don't you have Thanks. winter fruit that uh, and trees that are begging for your attention? Okay. Uh, I'm going to see you again in two, three weeks for lunch. What are you going to bring me to eat from your garden? Anything you got well, anything I do that. I'd do all of those things if I didn't have to take a nap. Well, what about are you going to bring me some oranges uh, now that the time has changed and you're going to adjust? What are you sure, if I knew whether it was daylight or uh, standard time. Yeah. All right. So you actually are saying that you do want the change of of time because it gives you another excuse to be tardy. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so we've wasted another good, what, six, seven minutes here. Uh, Art, I will see you soon when they change the clocks again. Okay. Uh, good. <laughs> see you, folks. For more on Celebrating Act Two, visit our webpage, follow us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and tell your friends. Celebrating Act Two is the user manual for the second half of your life.